We're out here on the Fraser River on what we call the Fraser Flats. It's our annual electrofishing fish population survey here where we have an established reach of river that's about 600 feet long where we check on the fish population and we do that by using specialized electrofishing equipment that stun the fish. They put just enough electricity into the water so that we can capture them, but not enough that it would injure them. There are five people with electrodes in the water putting out that field of electricity and the fish get stunned and they net them up. Big scope in there. We have other people working as backup netters to net any fish that get missed. The three main species are brown trout, rainbow trout, and mottled sculpin in this reach. So we capture them, hold them in nets, and get all the data that we need off of them in order to measure what the fish population is in this reach. And as we do that every year, we can look at trends in the population. We can track all kinds of different parameters of what's going on with the fish population. The Habitat Project has definitely helped the quality of the habitat in this reach a lot. In the past, the river would get very wide and spread out and extremely shallow. Little to no adult trout habitat whatsoever. We're in much better shape than we would have been in this drought without habitat work being completed. Got to make a big swish with your net right over it. We couldn't do surveys like this without a good volunteer crew that's willing to come out. We get help from basically people involved in some way in the water community around the county. I get great participation and I'm always very thankful for that.